Hello and welcome to a syscard video tutorial. My name is Sergey and today we're going to speak about banners. Banners are used to inform and to attract customers' attention, so it is an important tool in your store workshop. Let's begin. Banners are added with a banners add-on. Add-ons manage add-ons. Banners management allows you to create text and visual banners. Here you can choose enable multi-language images URLs. That's all. Let's go to the banners page and there will be more interesting things. Here you can edit, delete, change the status of already existing banners or create the new ones. Let's add a new banner. I'm going to create a simple sale banner. Let's call it sale, position zero, type graphic banner. You can also choose text banner and a description that will be displayed at your storefront. Graphic banner of local. Sale. You can enter the text here that will be shown instead of the banner when it's gone open in a new window okay and one of the most important things about banners banners can serve not just to inform the customers but they can serve also as the links to some special places just let me enter the link here and i will show you done creation date okay status active and after that you should pay attention to the notes here they explain how to add your newly created banner to the storefront. I know how to do all that, so I just create and close this page. Good, let's proceed to the design layouts. For now, all the banners are presented at the home page. So I want to add another one here. Let's disable this one and add the new block. Create new block, banners, name, sale banner, template, original or carousel. If you have lots of banners in one place, if you want to group them and to switch between them automatically as a storefront. Okay, original, content, filling, right, manually, unused you can choose if you wish, sale, add banners and close. Create. Let's check our banner. Good. The banner was added. Now let's take a look at the changes. Here we go. Here is the old banner and here is the new banner. Guys, I changed the link and now it leads to one of the sale products. I think it's better than some external website. Okay. Sale. And here we go the page with the discount save 25 percent that's how you can combine banners and promotions you can also assign different banners for different categories for example tv banners for the tv category music banners for the music category and so on just don't forget that such changes uh, need to be done at the individual way out of the categories uh, just let me show you. first General categories layout. Add banner here. Go to any other place you like. Sale banner. Good. Deactivate it for all categories. And at that, proceed to the categories page. Electronics, for example. Individual layout. That's what I was talking about. Activate this banner, content, sale, fine, sports and outdoors, way out, activate, but change the content, delete this one and add something new, for example, shopping fees, books, Layouts, content, delete, add banners, 
give certificate. Oh no, holiday gift guide. Save. Voila. Now we have individual banners for individual categories. Let's take a look. Review. Holiday gift guide banner. <laughs> we have two of them here, but that's just a coincidence. All right, let's go to some other page. Sports and outdoors, as far as I remember. Shop with ease. Nice. And electronics must have sale banner. Just like it should be. That's how you can add different banners for different categories. That's all that I wanted to tell you about simple but powerful tool called banners. There is more to come, stay tuned, thanks for watching and see you in the next CSCART video tutorials.